Katika kipindi cha miaka mitatu tangu Sudan Kusini kujitenga na Sudan, nchi hiyo imekabiliwa na matatizo tofauti na leo sherehe za kuadhimisha uhuru wake hazijaonekana kuwa na mvuto wowote wakati idadi kubwa ya raia wake wakiwa bado katika kambi za wakimbizi wa ndani kufuatia uhasama baina ya majeshi ya serikali na waasi. Ali Manzu ana taarifa kamili. Ada ya miongo kadhaa ya vita baina ya Wasudan Kusini na wanajeshi wa Sudan vita vilivyopelekea kuwawa kwa zaidi ya watu milioni mbili unusu. Sudan Kusini hatimaye ilipata fursa ya kujitenga na kubuni taifa lao chini ya uongozi wa marehemu John Dimabior Garang miaka mitatu iliyopita. Na leo wa Sudan Kusini walisherehekea miaka mitatu ya uhuru mjini Juba, sherehe ambazo zilienda sambamba na zile zilifanyika katika balozi zao kwenye mataifa mbalimbali mbali, kote ulimwenguni. Lakini je, Sudan Kusini taifa changa zaidi barani na ulimwenguni lina kila sababu ya kusherehekea? Baadhi ya matatizo yaliyolizonga taifa hilo ni ukabila hasa katika ngazi za juu kwenye serikali ya Salva Kiir, ufisadi, matatizo ambayo upinzani nchini humo wanashinikiza mabadiliko. We need to sit down and talk so that we can see how can we come back on the track and move our people forward. Nobody said that we wanted to remove the government. Hata hivyo upande wa serikali umeulaumu upinzani kwa ushirikiano na wanajeshi wa waasi wanaomsikiza aliyekuwa makamu wa rais Rek Machara kwa kupelekea uhasama ambao athari zake zinasikika sasa. The failure of the talks came as a result of the rebels walking out from the talks. And the reason of them walking out was because of Two, three things. Mapema mwezi wa Disemba tarehe 15 mwaka jana waasi waliiteka miji kadhaa yenye utajiri mkubwa wa mafuta kulingana na upinzani wanamlaumu Rais Salva Kiir kwa kukataa kusikizana nao. The formation of our government yes we form our governments it was okay but we started one step was corruption. The second step was nepotism. The third step not delivering the services to the people of San Sudan as a new nation. This is just the first test. The first test that we look forward to, to, to pass. We are not going to fail because of this test. We will pass this test and we go forward. Sudan kusini na sherehekea miaka mitatu ya utawala binafsi, lakini huku shere hizo zikiendelea. Serikali ya Sudan kusini inatakiwa kurudi nyuma na kutengeneza sura ya taifa katika uwakilishi wa taasisi zake serikalini kwa manufaa ya maendeleo ya taifa hilo changa barani Afrika. Alimanzu, Katie and Leo.